Jason Kander is 37 years old, and today he made a very hard decision, and a brave one. He will not run for mayor of Kansas City. It's the reason that has drawn national attention. In an open letter released today, Kander, an Afghanistan war veteran, says he has post-traumatic stress disorder. After 11 years of trying to outrun depression and PTSD symptoms, he writes, I have finally concluded that it's faster than me, that I have to stop running, turn around, and confront it. Kander joined the military after 9-11. And at that moment, I just decided, like, instead of putting that in the someday category, I was going to just do that. I was going to serve my country. But tonight admits that service has left him needing help. Candor is not alone. About 8 million Americans in any given year will have PTSD, and between 11 and 20 percent of veterans. Some experts believe the number may actually be much higher. Candor writing, I was afraid of the stigma. I was thinking about what it could mean for my political future if someone found out. So much worse, he says, last week he called the VA for help. I found myself on the phone with the VA's Veterans Crisis Line, tearfully conceding that, yes, I have had suicidal thoughts, and it wasn't the first time. I think it's incredibly important that he's come forward with this because it gives veterans permission to give voice to what they're suffering from, and that mental illness is as real as any other form of illness. Tonight, Kander has a message. If you're struggling with something similar, it's okay. It doesn't make you less of a person. In fact, what Jason Kander is showing all of us is that courage comes in many forms. Cynthia McFadden, NBC News. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.